Hey, this is Ryan from Web Eminence doing another video on Google Ads. And this one is about location extensions. So if you've been using Google Ads for any amount of time, you probably know about ad extensions. And those are really important because they can extend your ad and make them larger and show different elements in Google search. Um, so the more exposure you get and the more real estate you get in Google Ads, the better. So ad extensions are really important. I did another video a couple years ago on all the different types of ad extensions, so I'll link to that one. But in this video, I'm talking about location extensions. And those are one of my favorite extensions for local businesses and one that I try to always set up with a local business. And let me show you a quick example search. If I search for dentist near me, you'll see a couple ads show up. Here's an example of site links. That's the site link extension, which can link people directly to other pages on your site. And if we scroll down, you see the map listings, which you're used to seeing in Google ads organically, but notice that the first one is actually an ad. So this is showing because uh, this person has linked Google ads to their Google My Business listing. So this is really a location extension here that's been activated. So by activating location extensions, you can show different elements on your ad, like I'll show you, but you can also show an ad in these uh, map listings here. But if we scroll down farther, we'll see a couple other ads that have some location extension info. So here's one ad and you can see they have this um, address here with the little map pin. So this is a location extension. It's also showing phone number and it's also saying hours and services may vary so this entire line is showing because of the location extension it also has it looks like site links above it and up here that's showing a call out extension as well so this ad is getting a lot of um, extensions showing right now and you can see it has a very large ad so that's to their advantage here's another one down here that has the location extension showing i'm on desktop now obviously so this will look a little bit different on mobile but people will probably still see the location or maybe a clickable phone number that they can um, click to call so you can see the power behind location extensions and why you should really want to set it up it's not hard to set up and I'll just show you some of the basics of how you do that you do first of all have to have a Google my business listing and you can set that up at google.com slash business if you haven't yet um, it's called Google My Business, and you can create your listing and add some information about your business, like the hours, some photos, the location. You will need to verify your address. So these are verified business listings by Google. This will allow you to show um, in these maps organically, like these people are here. But again, once you link it to Google Ads, you'll be able to show as an ad above um, or with these organic listings. So once you create a Google business listing at google.com slash business, and actually I did another video on that a couple years ago to detail how you set that listing up. So I'll link to that video as well. But once you have your Google business listing set up, what you're gonna do is link Google ads to Google My Business using the location extension. So within Google ads, I'm now, I'm now in a Google ads account. If I click on a campaign, and then under ads and extensions, I'm gonna click extensions. I'm actually already there. And you can click this blue button to add a location extension. And I'm already linked up to this business account, the uh, Google My Business account I just showed you. But you'll need to go through the process here of linking up to a Google My Business listing. So they're gonna give you a few options to sync locations. You can search for it. You can um, put in an email address. If you're using the same Google account, it might be linked automatically, um, and that would be the, the best case, but you might need to do a little bit of work here to link the two. I already have one location selected here. So you may have multiple locations for your business, or maybe you have different locations linked to a Google Ads account. So you can use this tool here to filter out certain locations for certain campaigns. So once this location extension is approved and you've added it here, you can save it and it can begin showing in your Google um, ads campaigns. So it's actually very simple, but a lot of people probably don't know about this or they don't go through these steps to link um, their Google My Business account to Google ads. So they never have a location extension added. And then if your competitors do, they're gonna have that advantage over you. So definitely take the time to do this or ask your 
um, manager for your Google Ads account to take some time to do this for you and it's going to help you out a lot. So I'll go ahead and link to the next video here where I talk about all the Google Ads extensions and we'll see you on that video.